Ma Maria Redkina has joined us. Lion's Head Jewelers, Lamina, thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me. Glad to have you here. Let's jump into product right away. The colors that you brought, again, I love them. You're into this blue, and then we're going to go rose gold. Yeah. So uh, the set that I have right over here is actually um, aquamarines. Aquamarine is a gorgeous semi-precious stone. You know, it's not uh, your sapphire that's very deep, dark blue. Right. Uh, it's not your tanzanite that has a lot of purple. It's not your uh, blue topaz as well. It's more of an ocean blue. You know, it's it's a very very nice light blue color. <clears throat> very inviting. Exactly, very inviting. Very very, inviting, very, a very, uh, very fresh kind of looking. So, it's it's uh, quite popular um, these days. Um, so, aquamarine, uh, emerald, and morganite that I brought in that you see here on the other end, Kay. they're actually essentially uh, from the same family of stones. So they're oh, all no barrel. Kidding. Yeah, so basically morganite is your peachy pink aquamarine. Huh. I um, learn something every day. Thank you for teaching me absolutely, today. Absolutely, absolutely. And morganite uh, became extremely popular in the past uh, three years, I would say. And that's because of the rose gold as well. Um, okay. My personal um, opinion, because it looks the best in the rose gold. Uh, it looks very diamondy. Right. Like um, you can almost there are a few pieces that you can think it's a color diamond or something, okay. because both of these stones they're uh, clean stones, so you don't see normally you don't see inclusions. So you always judge them by the color. And uh, both of them have basically there is uh, there is a specific color that's uh, 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 trade uh, um, uh, basically uh, trade thinks is the best or the most valuable. But I think colored stones are so much fun. You know, all the different colors are so different that uh, whatever talks to you, whatever talks to your personality. Speaking of fun, I want to go here because it just keeps catching my eye. <laughs> this is one of my favorite pieces that you bring in. The one that I like the best is the Crescent Moon, but I love this one too. Tell mm -hmm. us what this is. So uh, this ring right here is made by a uh, company Toyful out of California. So they're a ball bearing operated ring. Right now display, what it does, it actually basically just gives it a little kick and that's why you see a tons of movement. But you're going to become a battery motor for your own ring. The more you move, the more your uh, uh, gestures you do and stuff, um, the more your ring's going to move. So they're great conversation pieces. They're set in 14 karat gold with diamonds. As you said, there are tons of other ones. Right. This is just a very tiny, small example of the collection. And you weren't going there, but it kept catching my eye, so I had to mention it. Yeah, and uh, right in front of it, this is Gabriel Schafrat with his Liberty Diamond. So this company is out of Germany. These guys are genius. Um, so they're the only ones, the first and the only ones that set the diamond free. So the diamond is actually set completely loose. Um, the diamond goes 360 around, tilts different directions, which allows it to catch about three times more light. Basically, the outsider doesn't know uh, that your diamond is loose. Right. Without the, the outsider see uh, is uh, the movement. Basically, the, the, uh, I, I'm talking about the sparkle, 